So VP24 is somewhere around here. He said it was over by the destination chargers. See a bunch of Teslas and a Roadster and a white Roadster. There she is. <laughs> as much as someone would wish it was, that is not a demo vehicle. I guess they allowed him to park it here because he got stuck. Just got the ignition switch off the column, and there's our problem right there. The tip of the lock cylinder broke off inside the ignition. So easy fix. We can at least turn the car off now and get it charging. So look at that. That is too close for comfort. So we got her turned off. Way too close. Charged up here. There it goes. That's a beautiful sight right there. Yes it is. All right, so we're going to unhook the airbag now that the car is off. So to do that, you just get this yellow harness down here, and pull down this tab, and it will release. It should release relatively easily. Not this coming loose. So you just pull that yellow tab and make it out of the way in case. Yep. And moment of truth. There she is. And it didn't blow up. Yep. So now we can unbolt the airbag from the wheel. It's just two bolts. One there, one there. To so thrust our red bag. Oh, would you look at that? Yep. And we just pop it off. Leaning back because I'm scared at this point. Right oh, there. look at that. So let's set it someplace away from the car. Here's where you can do some damage. You want to tape the clock spring back here to the wheel. So if you separate those and the clock spring moves around, it'll, it'll damage. It'll get damaged. Those are hard to find, right? Yeah. Like 400 bucks. Like, like four or five hundred dollars. If you're lucky. If somebody has one. Yep. We found that this is the 50th steering wheel on any roadster ever made, which is about what we thought this car was in the sequence. And check this out. The steering wheel nut isn't even torqued down. See that? So the owner's been talking about how the steering wheel shakes on the highway, and this, this may be why. <laughs> so we'll... I would bet money on it. Yeah. This makes our job a little easier taking it off, but that's just kind of scary. All right, so we're going to crank the wheel off now. And I think that's all it took. Oh, that's it? Wow. Uh, it was barely on there. Jeez. Dude. This is the third thing that we found that's made this car completely unsafe. And I've been daily driving it for three years. Alright, there's your loose nut. You got the wheel off, we're ready to pull the lock cylinder out. So the way to do this, you stick a pick or just any thin metal tool in this hole. Is it going to shoot out? Shove it in there, it'll shoot out. You gonna hit me? Nah. Yeah. Turn the key, put the key uh -huh. in, and turn it about halfway. There it is. Oh, look at that. That's all there is to it. Yep. See the broken tip there? Just the tip. Yep. All it takes. 